Assalamualaikum and greetings to all. Welcome to our talk shows series from University Science Malaysia. My USM and I'm Shadat Nakhidin, your host. For your information, this series is an initiative by Media and Public Relations Centre, MPRC University Science Malaysia, and will be emphasised on the feedback, comments and response from USM communities about their feeling, perceptions and etc. about University Science Malaysia. Alright, without taking a lot of time, in our series today, we will be interviewing our international student on their perceptions and how they see USM in the perspective as an international student. So, today we invite Ms. Mr. Musa Poria from Iran in doing his PhD in English Literature. So, Mr. Musa, welcome to our talk show series for today and hope you are doing well today. Uh, thank you very much, Shatad, and thank you for inviting me here. Okay, you're most welcome. And please make a simple introduction about you. Uh, well, I'm Musa, I'm from Iran, as you said, and I'm doing my PhD in uh, English Literature at the School of Humanities. And I started my studies uh, in 2015. And uh, so far, I've been here doing my research. Oh, I see. All right. Thank you, Mr. Musa, for the introductions. Now, I would like to ask you just a little bit of questions. So, why you choose University Science Malaysia? Uh, well, there are a few factors I, uh, I, I had in mind in selecting USM, uh, one of which was the, uh, its great reputation back in my country and the high uh, uh, employment rate of the graduates uh, there. And also, when I uh, looked for the university online, then I noticed the uh, presence of uh, well-known scholars and uh, lecturers like Prof. Saleh and uh, Prof. Shakila at our school. And uh, well, uh, the, the facilities that USM offers to students, uh, they all gave hand in hand to motivate me to apply uh, for a course here. Okay, so Mr. Musa, what are the things that you find amazing about University of Science Malaysia? Oh gosh, that's a difficult question because there are so many interesting things. Uh, uh, but uh, one is that uh, sometimes when I get tired of my studies and I want to go out of the lab, there are so many cultural events going on around in the campus and, uh, and also the availability of the different uh, sports facilities that uh, makes you sometimes forget about the uh, hardships of the research oh, you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Okay, so what is some kind of the events that you have joined in USM? Uh, so many events and uh, I can say that uh, one I'm contributing mostly recently and I'm also one of the, uh, I'm actually the chairperson is the International Conference on Humanities uh, to be held in December 2016. Oh, okay, I see. So, uh, Mr. Musa, how do you see USM communities in various culture here at USM? Well, uh, I can say it's a USM campus. It is a sort of like microcosm of multicultural, you know, uh, milieu for me. Because once you go out there, there are so many people from different countries. You can easily connect with those and you know, make friends and, and get to know different cultures. And uh, well, that's that's a very multicultural milieu. Mm, I see. So, did you find it difficult to to get into those uh, various cultures? No, not at all. People, uh, in the first place, people are friendly, yeah. especially the Malaysians themselves. And secondly, there are, uh, you can add it to the interesting things, uh, the question you ask. Wow. There are so many cultural events going on, cultural festivals, food festivals, and you can easily uh, you know, participate and get to know the different cultures and make connections and then, then it makes uh, life much easier here. Okay, so uh, Mr. Musa, would you like to recommend your friend to come and study to US? I mean, how do you see Penang Island? Oh, I would definitely recommend my friends back in Iran. And actually, I'm working as a student ambassador of Iran in Institute of Postgraduate Studies and helping those students who have, or, or let's say, potential uh, candidates uh, who have uh, queries about the university. And uh, I have uh, I've uh, helped a few of them to apply and come over oh, here. And yes, uh, <laughs> and they are pretty much satisfied for the timing. And about Penang itself. It's a very peaceful place, and once you go out, you, it's, I, I can say it's a lot, sort of heavenly uh, with oh, so much you. greenery. <laughs> okay. okay, so lastly, Mr. Musa, are you satisfied with the environment and also the ambience here in USM? 
Oh, yes, definitely. I, I, I can say I genuinely enjoy and uh, you know, get motivated to uh, learn more about my own research here, uh, especially with the uh, facilities and the uh, databases we have. Uh, yes, so, I'm pretty much satisfied. <laughs> okay, thank you so much. So just a little bit for the last, what is your favorite food? Malaysia. My favorite food is nasi goreng ayam. Oh, nasi goreng spicy ayam. one. Spicy one. <laughs> Very oh, spicy. you love the spicy food. <laughs> yeah, okay. All right. Thank you, Mr. Musa, for the time, uh, answer and feedback for today. So we would like to thank you for this short session and hope you. you will find great insight into study in USM. Thank you again, Mr. Thank Musa. You. Okay, right. With that, this wrap up the session for today. I would like to take this opportunity to thank Media and Public Relations Center, MPRC University Science Malaysia, for this talk show. And thank you, and see you all in the next series.